Both my parents were total World War II nerds. My dad loved reading books on military tactics and had a weekend hobby building model airplanes. My mom organized our walks around Kamp Westerbork. She would march our family through the camp's open field by the bent up railroad tracks, weaving little narratives about the war and her dead uncle Johan, the resistance hero. As our hikes took us out of the campgrounds and into the surrounding forest, her attention turned to nature and the mushrooms that grow on the camp's periphery, pulling nutrients from haunted soil. I tried to memorize what she told me, which ones she could eat, which ones were poisonous, but there are so many. Foraging for mushrooms in the Netherlands is illegal, but sometimes you can't help yourself. On one of our hikes, we found a cluster of chanterelles right off the walking path. My mother and her brother wasted no time picking them, giggling as they stuffed their bounty into a plastic sandwich sack. That night, my father sautéed the mushrooms in butter and garlic and tossed them with fresh pasta. This was a rare treat in a country as orderly and managed as the Netherlands. Food picked by our own hands on our own plate by the end of the day. Gerrit Jongsma's story casts a long shadow that falls over even my favorite childhood memories. But it isn't so powerful that it can block out the joy I feel when I remember that meal. Around that same time, my sister and I were playing around in my father's book collection when we came across a Nazi porn comic book hidden on a high shelf. Its pages held an S&M free-for-all floggings and sex slaves branded with swastikas. My sister and I hadn't hit puberty yet, but we were absolutely fascinated. We smashed each other with pillows and drew swastikas on our butts, just like in the comic. That evening, my mom undressed us to put us in the bath and was horrified by what she found. But then she laughed. It turned out the comic had been given to my dad as a gag gift by one of my uncles. It's a fun memory, and I still laugh when I think about it. No one, not even Gekke Gerrit, can take that from me. <laughs> 